Shalini, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm doing get the look inspired makeup and outfit for It's Okay Not To Be Okay Korean drama for main lead So Yo Ji. This was a look she was wearing in the second episode and I'm in love with this Korean drama. So I really wanted to create this look. So without further ado, let's begin. Starting with makeup. The makeup is very simple but interesting. Before applying makeup, we need to prep our skin. I've already applied toner on my face. Now I'm applying under eye cream. This is by Secret Key. Next thing that I'm applying is vitamin B12. Chia seed range by the brand Face Shop. This is a really good moisturizer for sensitive skin. And then for primer for my makeup, I applied Makeup Revolution Pro Fix all over my face. Now, Soyo J is obviously fairer than mine and she has a very flawless skin. I had to color correct around my lips. For that, I'm going to use this orange corrector by LA Girl. I have my fingers in the middle of the fingers I have my lips in the middle of the spread. Now, for foundation, I'm going to use Nika Skin Shield Foundation in the shade. True Toffee. अच्छे से shake करने के बाद मैंने थोड़ा सा इस foundation को अपनी fingers में निकाला है and then I'm gonna evenly spread it all over my face except under my eyes because we'll be using concealer under that area. Concealer के लिए मैंने use किया है my OG Maybelline Age Divine Concealer in the shade Caramel. I love this concealer. I never need to like color correct under my eyes whenever I apply this concealer. I also apply this concealer on my eyelid for a flawless base because we'll be applying nude eyeshadow on our eyes. So we need to make sure that everything is one skin tone. Now with the help of a foundation brush, I'm going to blend everything all together, pressing the product into my skin and then dragging it, sometimes also going with a circular motion. This foundation brush is not my go-to foundation brush. I have to press a beauty blender with my product to press it on my skin. बाद में ना सो ये जी आई होप आई एम प्रोनाउंसिंग द नेम करेक्ट फॉर हर आई हैड अ रियली fuller eyebrows and I have like fuller eyebrows but my eyebrow ka shape and their eyebrow ka shape is very different hai. so I really wanted to make it like very very bushy so I'm using my go to new favorite eyebrow pencil this is by Bolly Glow and then using the gel side I'm gonna push everything upwards and set my eyebrows in place to set my eyebrows furthermore I'm going to use Nika Oh My Brow eyebrow gel and then I have set my eyebrow ko intact kiya, set kiya kafi now starting with eye makeup, now I had to watch so many Korean YouTube channels and also I went through Google images just to see what kind of eye makeup technique Korean people like to do and oh my god guys their eye shape is so beautiful and obviously they are pretty different than ours. I have almond eye shape you guys can see that. So I picked up some of the eye makeup technique which I'm going to show you in today's video. So firstly you saw that to set my concealer on place I used this nude eyeshadow from all I need eyeshadow palette. I applied that all over my lid and also on my crease. And next I'm using this orange color from that same blending brush and I'm focusing this color mostly on the outer half of my crease and pushing the product just a little bit on my crease kind of creating a V there and also I applied this color very close to my upper lash line kind of like an eyeliner but it should have that faded eyeshadow effect so yoji the main lead of it's okay not to be okay wasn't wearing a black eyeliner she was kind of wearing a dark brown eyeliner so i'm going with this dark brown kajal by maybelline and applying that very close to my upper lash line and kind of creating a very small flicked wing there and i'm gonna smudge this a bit using that same orange color and i picked that color using that angular brush this is by color bath now using Makeup Revolution setting spray, I'm going to wet my pencil brush and then I'm going to pick this golden highlighter color from this three color face palette and I'm going to apply that all over my lower lash line. So you want to squint your eyes a bit uh, to apply that all over your lower lash line. Korean people really like to do that. It kind of makes them look very young and youthful. So I have It's Okay Not To Be Okay ke episode dekh liye hai, kuch do episodes and when I have Soyo Ji ke lower lash line, ko check kiya hai, she always had that highlighted lower lash line so that is what I'm going for. Now using my angular brush by Colabar again and picking that orange color, I'm going to be placing this color on the one third of my lower lash line, kind of creating a lower wing if that makes any sense. I've seen a lot of YouTube Korean channels and they really like to do this technique to enhance their eye look a bit. And this is a pretty different technique. I've never tried this technique and I really wanted to see how much of, of a difference it will make on my eyes. And trust me guys, this is quite intimidating. I also deepened this curler using that brown color from that palette again. Now, so ye ji wasn't wearing any eyeliner aur jab bhi wo eyeliner pehenti thi wo bahut hi halka sa dikhta tha unki eyelid pe i really wanted to match the lower wing of my eyes with my upper wing so i 
went with this black eyeliner this is by sugar cosmetics and i created a very small flicked wing on the outer corners and then i curled up my eyelashes using this miniso eyelash color and applied mascara all over my eyelashes this is by forever 52 and she had a very lengthening eyelashes so i wanted to go for a bit of a filler but lengthening look and this mascara is just amazing i really like the bond of it so i upper eyelashes ko coat kiya aur lower eyelashes ko coat kiya hai and then i quickly realized that i forgot to highlight my under eye area and also to set my under eye area so i'm using this maybelline fit me concealer in the shade 25 and applied that on my inner corners and also on the outer corners and then i blended this using my beauty blender Now quickly gonna use some banana powder and set my under eye area around my nose and also around my lips. These are the area which tend to get very very oily especially around my nose and around my lips. Now so Yuji had a very chiseled contoured nose. She's naturally very very beautiful guys. So I wanted to go for a very chiseled nose. So I have contoured my nose very well. And using that same brush, I'm going to blend my contour. And I'm going to highlight the center of my nose using that Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 25. And I blended that concealer with the help of my beauty blender. And I also set the T-zone area with the help of a banana powder later on which I forgot to film. Now using this contour brush by Pro Arte and picking that contour color again, I'm going to be contouring my cheeks, my forehead and also on my jawline. And I also contoured my cupid's bow because her cupid's bow was very much visible whenever I've seen her on screen. And for blush, I'm going for a matte peach blush. This is by LA Girl. Up to you guys will understand that the entire makeup is on the peachy pinky side. Now Soyoji was wearing a pinky peachy nude lipstick so I went for this exotic color by NYX Lingerie and applied that all over my lips. And lastly to add some more lengthening effect on my eyelashes i applied false eyelashes this is my miss claire so i cut the eyelashes in the half after like adjusting the eyelashes on my eyes and then using some eyelash glue i placed that eyelashes on the outer half of my eyelid now for hairstyle, I'm going to be splitting my hair into two section and I'm going to be curling the lower section only because anyway, the upper section is going to be on the back. So taking one in section of my hair and placing that hair on my curling wand, waiting for 10 seconds. And you guys can see that I'm curling my hair away from my face and that is what we want to have that fuller effect. So after curling one side of my hair, I'm going to be curling the other side of camera and this is what my hair looks like. And then I parted my hair in the middle and then I clipped all of my hair backwards. This is a very easy hairstyle, you guys can see that it's not much of magic, tha nahi, but this was looking so beautiful with the entire look of hers. Now for earrings, I'm wearing this dainty earrings. This is by the brand Desperi. I was looking similar hi earrings in Mintra. Mein dikha. Ji haan, I bought this earring just for this look, but I really like it. And with that, we completed this makeup look. I really hope you like this makeup, guys. It's very simple, but some of the eye technique is pretty unique. For example, highlighting the lower lash line, creating a lower wing on the lower lash line so this is an inspired korean makeup look on indian skin and indian eyes and indian face now for the dress she was wearing a short black blazer trench dress i loved her dress so much it was making her look so classy and i found a similar pattern dress on mintra this is by the brand wowzers i will provide a link for it in the description box below you can also find similar kind of dresses on zara and h&m i'm also wearing long socks and my boots are from coops.com and with that we completed the entire outfit makeup hairstyle i really hope you found this video interesting and entertaining and informative and if you did please make sure you subscribe to my channel and i will see you all next time with brand new content bye bye